Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about how the FB or Google Ad Manager chooses the best line item to serve based on their line item type or priority. So here I have a very quick spot quiz for you. What if there are multiple line items with the same priority? Which or how will the FB choose the best one to serve? So when I say same priority, I'm talking about this number right here. Right, so we have four, six, and four. Let me show you very quickly what that number is about. So when you go to your line item settings, when you choose the line item type, you will notice there's a corresponding number, right? By default, in Google Ad Manager, the lower this number is, the higher the priority. So depending on the level of access you have, this number is actually editable. So for some that has super admin access, they can edit this number to set the priority. Regardless what line item type you choose, this number would determine prioritization. Okay, so let's go back to that slide that I showed you earlier. So in this scenario, we have standard, network, and price priority. All three different line item types, but with the same priority level, which is four. So in this scenario, how would DFP or Google Ad Manager decide which line item to serve? The way Ad Manager orders it is it will take the percentage-based line item types first, then goes to the absolute line item type, and last, unlimited. So based on this scenario, I want you to think about the answer. You can pause this video for a minute and think about it once you have the answer. Go ahead and proceed and continue watching the video. Okay, the right answer for this scenario is network with a priority level of four. The reason for that is because network is percentage-based. So percentage-based line item types are sponsorship and network. So DFP will choose the line item with the highest percent goal allotted. If, for example, both of them exists and they compete in exactly the same inventory or ad unit and they both have the same priority number, then the one with the highest percentage goal allotted will be chosen by DFP or ad manager. But what if they both have the same percent allotted as well? Then any of them will be chosen at random. Next is absolute based line item types. One is standard, the other one is bulk. Now, DFP will choose the line item with a lower satisfaction index. Now, what does that mean? That actually refers to the pace or how far, how close it is from your goal based on the line item settings that you have. So when you choose standard, notice that you have a quantity based goal here. So you, that's an absolute goal. And then you're going to specify your end time as well. It's the same exact thing when you do bulk. So you specify the impressions or the quantity as well, or absolute goal, and you will also have your specific end date. That means Google Ad Manager checks satisfaction index based on how close or how far are you from this quantity goal based on the end time or your deadline. So that's called satisfaction index. So if you are very close to your goal, if you're good, if you're following a good pacing in there, satisfaction index is high. But if you're like struggling to meet your goal and it's almost the like the end time for this campaign, then you're struggling and the satisfaction index is low. So in that case, the FP will then choose the one with the lower satisfaction index. But if both of them exists in the inventory and they target the same exact ad unit and their satisfaction index happen to be the same, then any of them will be chosen at random. And lastly, unlimited, that's the price priority line item type. So DFP will then choose the line item with greater CPM or value CPM. Remember when we choose price priority, it's going to choose or this rate right here will determine its priority. The higher this rate, the higher the priority in the auction. So what if there are multiple price priority line items with the same exact CPM settings or rate in there, then any of them will be chosen at random. So remember this order 
when you're checking why your line item type is not serving or why is this line item type winning instead of the other. This is how Google Ad Manager orders the priority. First, percentage-based line item types. Next is absolute-based line item types. And lastly, unlimited. That's it for today. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and to subscribe to our blog to learn to monetize more. Hope to see you here again soon. Bye for now.